host, New, and I'm back at you with some more Starfield first playthrough. The moment has arrived, the game has officially launched, Steam, Xbox Game Pass, and Xbox users. It's a glorious time, and we finally arrived at... Captain. Hey, what's up, Vasco? Do you mind if I ask you some personal questions? You may. I have no concept of privacy. I'd like to know what makes you tick. I will answer your questions truthfully. Unlike you, I am incapable of lying. How'd you become a part of Constellation? Constellation recovered me from an abandoned lunar robotics factory on Earth's moon where I was manufactured. I am told I was in quite a state of disrepair. Barrett elected to refurbish me after the discovery. Since then, I have been reprogrammed to be useful to Constellation. You were built on the Earth's moon? That is correct. I am a first generation Model A robot. As such, I was manufactured on Earth's moon. Modern lunar robotics products are manufactured elsewhere. Do you remember anything? Some data from my time on Earth's moon remains deep in my motherboard, but I do not frequently access it. Very little of what is in those files would prove useful to modern spacefarers. It's a good thing they were able to fix you. Constellation is an exceptionally driven and intelligent group of humans. I would expect nothing less of them. You may ask me anything. I am programmatically incapable of keeping secrets. Thanks, Vasco. Return soon. Quite a bit of interesting information. Never knew that. It's interesting. The city of Neon. It's crazy. See that shroud covering Neon? Believe it or not, you're looking at the only city in the settled systems that powers itself from lightning. Crazy. So the city powers itself from lightning storms. Makes sense. Gotta keep the lights on somehow. Please, if you're tuning into this video and you want to maximize your viewing quality, turn your player to 4K60, its highest setting. Thank you. Looks like some sort of checkpoint ahead. It's probably designed to suck the credits directly from your pocket. This place has already given me water worlds and Blade Runner vibes. The new Blade Runner, the remake. forgot I was carrying it, is all. Honest mistake, right? Uh, can, can we just settle this right here? I can pay the usual. We don't make the news. That's Administrator Bayer's job. Now, shut up and start walking. Move it. Let's go. Yeah, Frank Rennick's all in a twist because his robot got vandalized. We had a good laugh about it back at the station. 
It never ceased to amaze me. We just arrived here at the city of Neon and stuff is already happening critical. People getting detained for smuggling. This is Neo. Looks nice. You did it. But those ecliptic mercenaries, factions, and resources. Free stock collected and you see. That's why they give them a white hair. Ask me. Asshole should be blasted into space dust. So, being at the game has finally officially this district launched. Certainly provides Still see a lot of negative feedback, a lot of negative from their tower and out into the city. Stuff trolling and making fun of the NPC models, so forth and so forth. And it's crazy. The game is just absolutely phenomenal looking to me in every aspect. I, like, I still have yet to run into an issue. No issues. The game looks amazing. As we, before we just walked forward just now, I was meant to be saying to myself that this game doesn't even have RTX ray tracing, but yet these puddles and the reflections and the lightings, lighting system from the, from the screen, excuse me, from the screen space reflections, makes me, have me literally saying to myself, it, it looks like ray tracing is enabled and it's not. There is no ray tracing. city seems heavily active and populated with NPCs. Like I said, it just brings the game together, gives it that complete feel, makes you feel more immersed. Like, I'm just, I'm just really happy and excited to play this game. It's a huge success for Bethesda. Congrats to the studio. Industries, can I help you? Yes, you can. Just arrived from New Atlantis. You must be one of the candidates that Imogene Salzo is interviewing today. Her office is down the hallway to my left. Take another left at the conference room, follow it around to the right and up a small flight of stairs. Then take a left and keep heading that way until you see her office. Sounds like a maze, right? So, if you want me to walk you back there or have any questions, just let me know. I'd appreciate it if you show me the way. Of course. Follow me. Not a darn thing wrong with this NPC's facial structure or facial model. Not a darn thing. This current floor we're on is the main operations level. It's where the grunt work happens for this department. Research, data entry, more busy work than you can stay. Most of the people here are technicians that report- Oh, I can't imagine being forced to spend my days doing menial work in an office like this, instead of exploring the stars on the bridge of a spacecraft. in there. I'll probably see you on your way out. Like I said, anyone trying to downplay the NPC awesome. models on here Have a seat. is lying. And your friend can wait outside. I'm sure they understand. All right, just to get a few things straight here, I'm Imogen Salzo, Senior Operations Specialist here at Ryujin Industries. I don't normally do this, but my counterpart, Yuko, is indisposed at the moment, so here I am. We're looking for someone to fill an entry-level administrative position. 
Apparently, our algorithm has failed us and believes you to be a decent match. Which I'll take up with our technicians later. So, let's get this over with. Why do you want to work for Ryujin Industries? I heard you only hire the best and the brightest, so here I am. I'll be sure to let our marketing team know their phrases are catching on. But I hope that's your sense of humor showing. Not to say we don't have our share of self-important attitudes here. In fact, you'd fit right in where some are concerned. But, moving on, why do you consider yourself qualified for a job like this? It's not that I'm qualified, I really need this job. Wow, I gotta love that answer. Almost as much as I love being stuck in this position, this is truly the highlight of my day. So, let's move on, shall we? How motivated are you to succeed? I'll go above and beyond to get the job done. All in, huh? At least that's an attitude we can work with here. And finally, my last question. If you worked here for five years, what role would you see yourself in? Hopefully I'll have a role in management here. I'd say that's reasonable, and not outside the realm of possibility. So look, since there's a million other things I'd rather be doing than this, not to mention that this isn't even my job, you're hired. On a probationary period? Of course. First order. There's a meeting starting soon, and I need you to pick up the coffee order at Terra Brew. Fairly easy, so you shouldn't be able to screw it up. If there's a line, skip it. Tell them you're here for Imogene Salzo, and you should get served right away. All right, first order of business, Uber Eats slash DoorDash. That's what my job is. Been a long time since I've been to Mars. Soul system doesn't get a lot of traffic. I have a few questions. Fine by me. What do you consider your area of expertise? You mean, apart from being the chair of Constellation for the past five years? Well, let's see. I pride myself with my aptitude for astrodynamics, calculating optimal trajectories for grab jumping. That's been quite useful in the past. And as far as planetary exploration, my area of expertise is botany. So don't worry, I won't let you eat anything that might put you in the hospital. <laughs> That's all for now. Very well. Next time then. Okay. Great chat, Sarah. This intel could blow a whole operation out of the water. To the lobby. I'm just now noticing the Chinese art style dragon hanging from the ceiling. I didn't even notice that when I first walked into the office or to that building. I didn't even notice it. That's why I need to take my time and enjoy the scenery. What makes this RPG to me, I already feel like it's one of the best all time, is that it's, there is no right and wrong way to play this. Play at your own pace. The decisions you see me make, you can completely do something completely different. So what you're seeing me do, even down to the responses, you can you can go about them completely different, your way. You can get a 
a different outcome and results in the same scenarios. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hey, to pick up an order for Emil Jean Cizo. Oh, the reunion order. You must be new. What happened to Tomo? Did he finally get that promotion? I got fired. Is what happened. And this is the soulless soup they got to replace me. Tomo, I'm sorry. I know how hard you were working for that promotion. Four years behind a desk. Getting coffee, kissing up to that high and mighty Ularu Chen, just to get replaced by this nobody? It's not my fault. All I did was respond to an ad. <sighs> Hearing that ad should have been the first sign they were going to get rid of me. I bet Ularu was just waiting for the moment to hire you. And now that I've been terminated. It's only a matter of time before they send you after me. So I'm taking matters into my own hands. Believe me, it's either you or me. No one's been sent to terminate anyone. Now, why don't you just calm down hmm? before someone accidentally gets hurt? You want to talk? <laughs> I'll tell you what. You get one chance to prove you deserve this job. Change my mind, and I'll walk away. Fail? <laughs> and I think you know where this is headed. You're throwing your life away here. You, you can't be that good. Not yet. Look, at some point, Ular really will send you after me. Just, just promise me you'll remember this. That, that when I came after you, I gave you the chance to talk me down. You're either one of the few good people in Neon, or you already know a thing or two about leverage. Just don't make me regret this. I'm going to hold you to that promise. That went very well. I am good. I've played Bethesda games before. Thanks for watching. Not every conflict has to be resorted with violence. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Till next time, peace and be well. Noob out.